Administering oaths of office on the members of the new executive of the party by the national chairman of Labour Party, Dr. Ayo Olu Remi, said the new leadership of the party in Edo State came on board due to the expiration of the tenure of the Ogbaloi led executive council, which ended in April 2024. He said the new leadership of the party in Edo State is expected to take charge of the affairs of the party. He said the Labour Party decided to appoint Mrs. Elizabeth RTV as Edo State chairman due to her track record. What the Labour Party is passing through now is just necessary for the type of party we are. In a speech, the member representing Oedo Federal Constituency in the House of Representatives, Engineer Esosa Yawe, commended the national leadership of the Labour Party for appointing Mrs. Elizabeth RTV as the chairman of the Ketika Committee. Also speaking, the member representing Ego Ikbubaoka Federal Constituency, Mr. Murphy Osaro Omoyi, congratulated the new leadership of the Labour Party in Edo State and stressed the need to unite all aggrieved members. With the caliber of people here, we know that we are going to reconcile all the aggrieved loyalists and followers that we have. I am very, very confident today, more than ever, that our battle will emerge. In her acceptance speech, the new Ketika Committee Chairman of the Labour Party in Edo State, Mrs. Elizabeth RTV, assured to move the party to a higher level. She promised to reconcile all aggrieved parties and vowed to constitute a reconciliation team to resolve pending issues in the party. The Secretary of the Party, Osses Emmanuel Irunsele, lauded members of the party for their turnout during the inauguration. I believe that God has chosen all of us to make a difference. In his reaction, Kelly Ogbaloye says if that's how they intend to run the party, he will support any move that will uplift the party and make it win the forthcoming governorship election. A full sub world, ITV News.